this tutorial is dealer selected row in grid view with sql so i just added a grid view now design the um, grid view header style back color yes this is the header style back color now in the face load event i will write code to load data from sql to grid view so i'm adding link with sql classes link you file yes this is the link you file added now go to the server explorer and add the table from the uh, server explorer yes the table is student info tab now and the link you uh, connect with the link you file data class data context db equal to new data class data context okay this is the data class dot dbml now i'm gonna add a method by load data this method will be used to load data from SQL Server database to grid view. So, by restricting from SNDB dot uh, student info tab, select as grid view under data source equal to ST grid view under data bind. Now, call this method if not is post back. Call this method in the phase load event. View in browser. Yes, the data is loaded successfully in the grid view. So, now i'm gonna add a link button in the grid view in that case i have to add a column and then sp bound uh, sp template field then item template in this item template i will add the link button go to toolbox drag the link button and uh, text link button text is delete and go to the click event double click to link button to get the click event yes and just uh, cut and paste it in the item template in the grid view okay the link button is added let's check yes link button is added in the grid view so now i'm gonna write code to delete selected row using grid view from sql so integer row index equal to grid view row sender as control dot name and container dot row index student id grid view on dot rows row index and cell cell is index 1 let's check index 0 is link button and index 1 is a student id so index is cell is index 1 dot text oh this is integer type so need to convert to integer okay it's done now bar st delete equal to from s in db dot student info tab where s dot student id equal to st id what i have declared select s dot passed db dot student info tab this is the table name dot delete on submit st delete db dot submit changes call the method to reload data in grid view yes now let's check click to delete 104 yes it's deleted successfully 105 also deleted now i'm gonna add in confirm masses um, before performing delete operation so in the link button just write on client click are you sure to delete question mark now add return space confirm first break single quotation then close to quotation and break okay now yes are you sure to delete cancel it's not deleted if you select delete okay then it's deleted successfully thanks for watching this tutorial